I went from 20% to my last test, which was 70%. I've gone from about late 40s to late high 80s. 18% to 85%. In virtually all cases, students are reporting very favourably on their results to the point that some students are saying 50% increase, 60% increase. Maths Power, a software program that takes students through each step of the maths curriculum. It sets the questions, you submit the answers and it helps out if you get stuck. What sort of difference has it made to your results? Um, quite well actually. I've gone from around 18% to, a, well my last test I got 82 or 83% on that. A pilot scheme introduced at Sinclair High School already has 450 of its students enrolled. Instead of dropping maths through sheer frustration, students are now more likely to excel at the subject. According to Principal Alan Jones, parents just can't believe the sudden turnaround in results. That's been outstanding. Absolutely outstanding. Tamar, like thousands of parents, wanted a solution. Um, we did try some um, tutoring, um, which was very expensive. Uh, we couldn't continue with that, and that's when we turned to Maths Power. Three, four, five. Former school teachers Felicity Tanus and her husband Anthony spent five years developing Maths Power, which Felicity believes is a safety net for children who fall through the cracks in our education system. They can't move ahead to the next lesson unless they've got 90% or more understanding. That's where the key is. Plus 5 is 35, plus 5 is 40. They've improved dramatically, definitely. After um, we started them on, on Maths Power, um, after six weeks actually, they started to get some awards. Show me. Uh, I was surprised. I was surprised at how quickly they actually did start to improve. It only took about six weeks and then an improvement was, you know, was evident. Grade 6 student Alex Starling is another whose number crunching has been turned around by maths power. Dad Paul remembers how tough it used to be. I know that when Alex was having trouble with maths before, she'd build up these bridges she couldn't cross because she'd look at it and say, I can't do that, and her mind would just shut down. When they get the confidence, if they can use something like maths power to build their own confidence, it helps them a lot. And at around $200 a year, Maths Power is much cheaper than a tutor. Just a very simple, quick routine. This was my half yearly maths exam. I got 52%. And then this was a maths test I did not long after I started the program, 82%. That's a big difference, 30%. What did you think of that? I was happy. When they're explaining it to you, they highlight certain parts and you don't have... Um, any distractions, like like in a classroom full of 30 people, you're going to have other distractions, like what did you do on the weekend? Rah, rah. Lisa Donoghue is another maths convert. A year 11 student, she was struggling with even the most basic concepts until Mother Linda heard about Back to the Future education. She used to be scared of maths, you know, it used to put her off because she didn't know what to do but now she does know what to do it it doesn't put her off anymore and she's quite challenged by it it's lifted her confidence as well last year i was getting 40 percent in maths and this year i'm getting in the 90s last year sandra manor was ranked 14th in a class of 28 year 7 math students this year there are 129 in the class and she's the number one performer hello back to the future steve speaking oh hi sandra if they get stuck on a question, they can call a support line that's available to them between 4 and 7.30 every Monday to Thursday night. I got stuck on a question doing algebra. Yeah, OK. Which exercise are they up to? Exercise 3. Well, you've got 5 and you multiply by negative 3. I don't know how to do it. As a teacher, I felt there was almost like a silent majority of students in my own classrooms who you couldn't get to all the time. And, uh, but they wouldn't ask any questions. Then they'd go home and they'd just plot along and um, day by day and they needed to be able to go up and talk to somebody. Sometimes they got the courage and did so. A lot of the times they didn't. They're hearing what a teacher would normally be telling them but not with the background of the classroom. It's singular, you know, the headphones on and it's focused directly on them. And they get a chance to do that a few times, or as many times as they like. And, and you can't uh, 
pause and rewind your teacher. That's <laughs> you know, right, you can't rewind your teacher, yeah, and that's exactly what you can do here. We find that most children don't like doing homework, so therefore uh, the system had to be structured in a way that it was very little time taken of the child, in, in fact um, 20 minutes, 25 minutes at the most, two or three times a week, helps a child really excel. She went from 17% um, and four months later, after doing the course, she got 97%. Yeah, I was surprised, like 97%. Oh, I was pretty excited, you know, got up in the middle of class yelling out, hooray, hooray. <laughs> For Sandra to come first out of 129 in her year, it makes me very, very happy. At $200 a year, parents like George Manor and Barbara and Nick Peterson say the course is proving great value for money. And what did you think when he came home with an 82% mark? Stoked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wrapped. It was good. It's actually just showing that it's actually working. Yeah, I used to muck around lots in class, not do my work because I didn't understand any of it. And since I've got the program, I'm understanding it and starting to listen more in class. She can explain to people how to do the mathematics that she couldn't do before. Going from 41% to 90%. It's fantastic. <laughs> Christy Kerrison and her brother Tim have been using maths power all year with great results. I was getting like low, like 50s, 60s. Now I find I've, I've got 95%. It's like using the latest technology and you just get to move it around and... It's just fun. St Clair Principal Alan Jones says this class is a test case. And we're finding that students are now extending themselves where previously they might not have. If they decide to get up early one day, it's there. If they work late, it's there. Let's count them. One. One. Two. Two. She more asks me to come and, you know, like that, let's go and do the lesson. So, and it's, it's, it's good being together with her and sort of sharing this little thing. According to Kip Barrett, his five-year-old daughter Taylor sees her early education as just fun and games. I'm learning to count and I'm learning to spell.